Hi everyone, welcome to our weekly video here at Knox, even though we haven't had one for, uh, for quite a few weeks now. Uh, today is a special video. I'm here with Debbie Campbell, who's one of the co-conveners of the Knox Guild. And uh, sitting on the other side is uh, Denise Lossier. Uh, welcome Denise and Debbie to this video. Denise uh, has been organizing the wine raffle fundraiser on behalf of the Knox Guild this year. And we're here today to do the wine raffle draw. There were 500 tickets available and all 500 were sold. And so we will um, uh, be making some, uh, some nice money with this raffle and the proceeds will go towards the uh, hoped for accessibility restroom uh, downstairs in Geneva Hall. So before we do the draw, uh, a couple of other notes. And uh, first of all, also a big thank you to Marianne Rasmus, um, who helped out even though she can't be here today, uh, recovering still from her surgery. But thank you to Marianne for all the work that you did to get the draw um, up, and, up and running. So much appreciated. Uh, before the actual draw, a, a couple of notes about Knox. Uh, this coming Sunday, we will have another baptism on Sunday morning of uh, this week of Kinsley Crony. She's the child of uh, Sarah and Malik Crony. And uh, interestingly enough to those who are longtime members of Knox, the uh, infant uh, baby uh, Kinsley is the great granddaughter of Hilary Hay. And uh, Hillary, if you're watching this too, we uh, look forward to, to seeing you hopefully this Sunday for the baptism too. As uh, many of you know, uh, uh, tomorrow will be a funeral for Mrs. Uh, Jessie Pretty. That is tomorrow here at the church in the sanctuary at two o'clock. And also finally, before the draw yet, uh, this coming Saturday, um, the Out of the Cold meal happens again. And uh, this week, uh, team number two is uh, preparing, planning, and serving the meal. Thank you to uh, all the volunteers who uh, are helping out again this coming weekend. So the draw, uh, Denise and Debbie. So what we're going to do is uh, I will uh, take out uh, one of the tickets and the first ticket that we will take out is the grand prize. And the grand prize, uh, if I'm correct, Denise, is uh, first place is... $250 worth of wine. It's eight bottles of wine. Perfect. So I will make the draw, and uh, I'm going to give the first ticket to uh, Debbie. She'll read the number, and then also uh, uh, say the name. It's ticket number 416, and the winner is Sandra McInnes. Okay, all right. Somebody's cheering. Congratulations, <laughs> Sandra. <laughs> Congratulations, Sandra. So that's the grand prize of a $250 worth of wine. And all of these tickets, all, all of them were sold, as I mentioned, and they're all in the baskets here. It's all been verified. And I'm going to try to take one. They've all been shuffled. Take one from the middle of the pack here. And I'm going to give this one. This is for the second place prize. I'm going to Which is $150 worth of wine. It's six bottles of fine wine. And the winner is Jessica Hellwig in a 519 area code. Mm -hmm. So somebody reached far afield yeah. for Jessica. Okay, congratulations, Jessica Hellwig. We have two more prizes, a third and fourth uh, place prize is the same amount. Uh, Denise, uh, maybe just remind people what the... It's $50 for each of the third and fourth place prizes, and that is a bottle of red and a bottle of white for each prize. So here's the third place. I'm going to get Debbie to read this one. And this one is ticket number 145. And the winner is Norma Lynn Pearson. Okay, Norma Lynn Pearson. Yeah. yeah. Okay, congratulations, Norma. We have one more. I'm going to go all the way to the bottom here. Yeah. And Denise, I'll get you to read this one. Okay. Number. Ticket number 287. And the winner is Joanna Duncan. Congratulations, Joanna. <laughs> so, she's a church member. Yeah, so, congratulations to everybody who won. Great. 
Um, thank you to uh, everybody who sold tickets and also purchased. And again, uh, we're hopeful that uh, the uh, funds raised will go towards uh, an accessibility restroom in Geneva Hall. Thank you again. Have a great week, everybody.